game day. Hello, night fans. Uh, today is the day. It's game day. I'm so excited. I'm also extremely nervous. First of all, there's no air in my car. There we go. <sighs> uh, let me actually let me not drive. Let me hold off in the driveway for a second. I'm game day af right now. I got the gold on the eyes. I got the tan on the body. The uni is on and strong. Hair is did done up. I'm about to be on my way to Kelly's house. We're gonna end up carpooling to the game. We got a little timeout practice on the field and then we have a whole lot of events. It's also extremely hot outside right now. It has to be at least like 98. It's disgusting. My makeup is not gonna look this good by the end of the night, but it's fine. It's also forecast. Hello? Oh, it's my mom. That's awkward. My mom was honking at me. It's also predicted to start storming really hard at five. That's when the gates end up being opened. This is what happened last year. Last year, I went to the game and I tailgated with a few friends and there was just this huge storm and they were just letting people in the gates and then they were like, oh no, you have to get out. There's lightning. And then in the stadium and oh, nope. Now you have to go back to the gates because there's lightning. Um, oh, actually get out of the gates and just step outside because there's lightning. Delay, 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 delay. I don't know, we waited like two, three hours and then me and my friends were just like, nah, bump this. Let's go to Buffalo Wild Wings and let's watch the game on the TV. The game was still delayed and by the time we got the check, it was like 11.30. That's when the game ended up starting. So that was interesting. Today we're against SC State. They got nothing on us. We're gonna win. If not, it's gonna be a really sad day for us because <laughs> this is my last first game ever first first game but also first last first game senior year baby but yeah i feel extremely pretty i'm really excited and <laughs> i'll take videos when i can wait you a fan of the magic Ooh, like an alec and Zim. i heard from a friend of a friend that that Hey guys, it's Kelly. What's up? And it is game day today. First game. Yeah. First game! It's the first game. Look how flush our palms are. It's just a great day. <laughs> and it's a good one. These palms are a lot better than my other ones. My other palm was like a sad little rat tail. These are fluffy! Don't let me! I'm so excited. We're in our little locker room. Say hi to me. Yeah, I'm a catfish. I know. I couldn't get much footage after we left the locker room. I know we took some pictures. <laughs> and then we had our timeout rehearsal. Nika. Hi, Blonde. Hi, Blonde. We are ready for time to die. We're ready. <laughs> And then we ended up getting on the golf cart that you saw and we rode around all of Memory Mall, uh, which is where all the tailgating happens. I saw a lot of drunk people. It was great, loved it. It was like raining really bad. We were supposed to do this thing called night walk, which is where we like security guard, walk all the football players onto the field, but it was severe thunderstorm warning. There was lightning. There was like a dude on the intercoms being like, emergency, find shelter immediately. Night walk got cut. We ended up at the alumni center and we got to like hang out with some little kids and mingle, talk to people, do a little photo op with fans. We met up with cheer there. Once cheer got there, we did a pep rally, just getting everybody hyped for the game. And then we were supposed to go do a little tour at Plaza so go into Burger U, do a pep rally, go into Nitro's, do a pep rally, and then in front of the basketball arena, do March to Victory. But all that got cut because of the rain. So we just ended up being in the locker room again. That's crazy. <laughs> you gonna smack who? I'm gonna do this to you. almost an hour I think that's about right and that's when we you know socialize had a little bit of fun had a little bit of a break before pre-game <laughs>
touchdowns later we ended up doing our timeout routine in the second quarter enjoy we came to win is getting it kind of fuzzy because I was at a high in terms of my adrenaline. After that, I don't remember if we finished out the quarter or if that point was halftime, but we went into the leadership building where we usually go in for study hall and we had our dinner. And we got one. Say hi, Juicy. Hey, babe, I love you. How are you, baby? Yeah? <laughs> How was the first two quarters, honey? Well, I just, on the rubber band, I definitely just jumped onto my neck, but I hit it. Yeah? Insert clip here. You'll see. I definitely just used my neck. No, but we like ate it though. No, we ate it. We ate it. Yeah. Hey vlog, um, being promo is fun. The dude made me run in two corners. What do you mean? Um, he had us going to one corner and we were on the complete opposite corner, so we had to run all the way around and I was on the field. Thank you, three! I yeah! <laughs> we were able to touch up and we actually had like a 15 minute break. So up to this point from pregame, it's it's just been like, go, go, go. And then after our lunch break, we just finished out the third and fourth quarter. We had some good times. <laughs> So live a life you will remember. My father told me when I was once a child, these are the nights that never die. My father told me, bum, 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 bum. It's more sidelines. <laughs> and the game finished out. Knights ended up securing a win, 56 to 10. We brought it home. First game is a wrap. Catch ya.